One morning, while the two kids are walking in the garden, Today, the sun is a bright spotlight in the sky. Yes, the sun smiles at me. Unlike yesterday, it rained hard. And I know I slept like a lot. I'm so tired because I played a million times. <laughs> Today, let us learn more about figurative language and sound devices. Did you notice the sentences written in red? They are figurative language. Figurative language is when you use a word or phrase that does not have its normal, everyday, literal meaning. Writers can use figurative language to make their work more interesting. First type of figurative language is simile. It is a comparison between one thing to another using like or as. I slept like a lot. Her face is as soft as the cotton. Next is metaphor. A comparison between two unlike things without using like or as. The sun is a bright spotlight in the sky. The pillow was a cloud that comforts me all night. Personification is the next. Personification is giving of qualities of a person to things not human, such as animals, plants, inanimate objects, or ideas. The trees dance in gladness when the rain comes. The dancing leaves played in the wind. Next is hyperbole, an exaggeration that is meant to emphasize a point. I am so hungry I could eat a horse. It took a million years for Thomas to finish his homework. Now, let's proceed to sound devices. Sound devices are resources used by poets to convey and reinforce the meaning or experience of poetry through the skillful use of sound. The first type of sound device is onomatopoeia. It is the naming of a thing or action by the vocal imitation of the sound associated with it. Zzz, the sound of the bees around the tree. Next is alliteration. Alliteration is a sound device which is the repetition of a consonant sound at the beginning of words. Example, Peter Piper picks a pet of pickled pepper. P sound at the beginning of a word. Next is assonance. Assonance is a sound device which is the repetition of the same vowel sound either at the beginning of words or inside the words. Example, may lay near the bay and stayed awake. Consonance is the next. It is the repetition of consonant sound and the stressed syllables but with different vowel sounds within or at the end of a line. Boat and night, cool and soul. Remember, figurative language is when you use a word or phrase that does not have its normal, everyday, literal meaning. Simile is a comparison with the use of like or as, metaphor without like or as, Personification, you are giving human quality to a non-human. And hyperbole, an exaggeration. Sound devices are resources used by poets to convey and reinforce the meaning of or experience of poetry through the skillful use of sound. Types are onomatopoeia, imitation of the sound, alliteration, first consonant repetition, assonance vowel sound repetition, and consonants. Same consonant sound repeats anywhere in the word. For your activity, analyze and identify the sound devices used in the sentences.
here are the correct answers. Did you all get the correct answers? Congratulations! If not, try again. See you next time. Bye!